This might just be my only chance of getting placement. I don't know. <laughs> and what if I don't get the email? Ah, that's going to be so devastating. I think I would cry, but I've cried a lot, so I don't think there are any tears left. <clears throat> Let's just hope for the best and prepare. That's the only thing I can do. Well, I just want to get placed ASAP and then I just want to start gym. Tomorrow is like a 
the first day of her seventh semester. So I just thought I'd like fill you in with what's up. So today was my Infosys specialist programmer exam. Uh, it was an OA. Uh, at 11 a.m. we had our exam and around 2 o'clock I got free. It was just three questions and when I tell you I couldn't complete the last one and the last two were from dynamic programming which I haven't really done quite well. So that was like terrible terrible. Point is that I am getting ready for my first day back at college and that's what we're preparing for i washed my hair which looks like terrible i would have to like comb my clothes out and redo them i also took out my nail polish because it was really chipped and uh right now i did like hello focus so right now i just applied some olive oil and i'm gonna massage them and then i will do my skincare because that is still left for that i'm just gonna like exfoliate put a mask on serum probably the shave my mustache something like that yeah while i was like doing all this i thought it'd be a perfect time to overthink yeah, let's do that. So, what if I don't get a placement? I mean, my life won't be over because of that. But my dignity will most definitely be over because of that. It's not even, you know what? It's not that I'm scared that, oh, if I don't get a job or if I don't get a campus placement, then I'm not going to do good in life. I'm a failure or something like that. It's more like... I don't want my mom to feel like her child couldn't even get a campus placement which would be so embarrassing if I don't okay I don't know if I should keep this in the video or not it's okay it's okay whatever me getting the placement not getting the placement is not my decision it's God's so whatever his plan is I am totally a hundred percent ready to face whatever he has I do get a little bit anxiety i do get a little bit scared here and there well of course these uh the placement season does affect your mental health i my sleep cycle is totally off and i'm so sure that i have lost weight because i went down to two meals like two proper meals because i wasn't up during the breakfast time yeah and uh about the whole placement drive experience and how you should prepare for placements and all the computer science students who are like in their second or third year and want to get a sneak peek of how you should prepare um i'll definitely let you know about it when i get a placement because you know i don't want to look stupid giving out advice to you guys when i cannot even like, get myself a job so let me get a job first okay and then we'll talk about how you're gonna get a job i really hope that this series like end soon because it's getting a little tough out here it's getting a little scary here you know yeah i'd like to like breathe with relief which i don't have right now that's the truth even though I'm like a big god person and everything, but like, I'm also a human, so I'm probably gonna put on some series. Currently, I'm watching uh, How to Train Your Dragon, uh, Dragon's Edge, Edge to the Race, no, Race to the Edge. It's easy to watch and it's like just 20 minutes or something, so doesn't require a lot of attention and it has two plus i'm gonna pop out my pimples that you cannot see because bro it's just an iphone what do you expect and watch my pretty little toothless i was thinking if i don't get a placement uh, i always have youtube so if 
<laughs> you see me posting really aggressively on YouTube after every three days you're watching my vlog and just that's all the hint you need it's kind of feeling sleepy but you know the moment it's 11 30 my sleep is gone or probably it was like this huge ass light on my face so that I can talk to you guys the things that I do for you anyhow okay I'll see you like I don't even know when but I'll see you okay oh my god yes and an important update I have gold that's all I wanted to say thanks bye catastrophic quake in SNA. well I think we should probably name it later Alexa set a timer for 6.45 alarm set for 6.45 here So I just got like I got my dinner right now and going to college was like such a waste today because first they rescheduled our class from 9 to 12 and we went there but no class was empty so it shifted to 12 to 1 but then the teacher just said never mind you know let it go we'll just do it We'll just have an extra class on Thursday. So yeah, first day of college, pretty meh. Yeah, so as you guys know, I gave my Infosys SP exam yesterday. We don't have any update of that as of now, but I was talking to people and like most of the reactions were like, we couldn't answer any question. Like uh, in Infosys SP uh, exam, you have to write the code and then the code is run on uh, multiple test cases. Uh, Proc DNA, that's another company, is gonna have their OA tomorrow. So uh, they didn't tell any timing or anything like that. So I'm just heading up my seniors, asking them if anyone, like, you know, how was Proc DNA last time? I'm going to have my dinner, watch some Netflix, and uh, also when I came back, I slept for a while because I was really tired. I was half asleep all day honestly i'm gonna yes i'm gonna focus on my dsa right now we also i'm in my seventh semester so like for the college we have to make a minor project under some teacher me and my friend we have to submit a synopsis tomorrow which she very kindly said Ash, that you don't need to worry about it i got it you can prep for your placement because she already got placed guys she was uh placed in a non-tech role in cs so that's amazing yeah that's it let's have dinner and i'll see you like while eating or something